Hello and welcome again to Fox Comics in beautiful downtown Marion, Illinois. And we are unpacking this week's comic book order. And it is Tuesday, June 15th. All of these items will go on sale Wednesday, June 16th at 10 a.m. We're going to start this week with some of the Chotsky that will be available on free comic book day. They are comic book bag uh, backpacks slash backpacks. Uh, it's a great way to save all the plastic from going out. Uh, that leaves the store every every week uh, in where you can bring your own re recyclable bag and bring your get your own books that way. Uh, continuing with the Chotsky, we've got some of the uh, metal statues from uh, Eagle Moss. This is the uh, Thanos um, wearing the glove, as you can see in that uh, wonderful picture there. And then, uh, let's see, we also will have uh, Ruby, uh, one of the mangas that uh, we carry is, Volume 3 is here, I believe this is a replacement order, but we will have those. Uh, then we have Jim Lives, uh, the mystery of the lead singer uh, of The Doors and The 27 Club. And uh, then uh, more Donnie Cates, and I believe this is uh, issue, or Volume 2 of the trade paperbacks of Donny Cates' Thor run, which has become wildly popular in our store. All right, we're going to get down to the comics because that's what you all paid for. Uh, for Marvel, we have issue four of Alien, and that is the issue four Alien variant. Uh, then from Ascent, uh, Wake Entertainment, we have Ascentia, uh, issue five, great cover. Uh, then from DC, we have, uh, for those of you that are doing the uh, Zero Point, uh, the Fortnite book. Uh, we have the Issue 5, and we also carry the variant covers of those. From Xenoscope, we have Bell Sirens, and uh, the beautiful variant cover for uh, Bell Sirens made our top five covers of the week. From Scout Comics, we have Issue 3 of Black Cotton. From Boom Studios, we have Issue 3 of Berserker, Keanu Reeves' book. Uh, and our variants for Berserker uh, all have damage in the lower left-hand corner. We're going to get those replaced. Diamond's usually pretty good about that. And then I believe the Frizone uh, Thank You variant is there. From Marvel, we have Captain America Annual, number one. And... Uh, the Lee Field 30 Years of Deadpool variant. And uh, yet another variant there. And one more variant just because. Then from DC we have Catwoman issue 32. And the, uh, I believe, Jenny Frazone variant for that is right there. A Blaze brings us uh, the Sumerian Iron Shadows in the Moon. Issue 3, and just a really cool variant cover for that. Image Publishing is up next with Issue 1 of Compass. Uh, Marvel brings us Demon Days Mariko. Uh, it's a Peach Momoko book, drawn and written. Gorgeous cover there, one of our top five covers of the week, um, as is the variant. Very, very pretty. Uh, from Titan Comics, we have issue three of uh, <clears throat> Doctor Who, Missy. Marvel's up next with the Fantastic Four, issue 33. And uh, the Sinister Villains variant is right there. The 30 Years of Deadpool variant from Rob Leafield is right there. And then Boom Studios brings us issue four of Firefly, brand new verse. And uh, from DC, we have The Flash, is issue 771. And uh, the beautiful Flash 771 variant right there, one of our top five covers of the week, so congratulations, DC. IDW's up next with G.I. Joe, A Real American Hero, issue 282. Hey, and guess what? Up next is IDW, G.I. Joe, A Real American Hero, issue 383. So the, both of those are in. Uh, Marvel is up next with issue 7 of Heroes Reborn. And uh, then the, um, I believe the uh, 
supervillain variant is Thor. And then the Stormbreakers is just a gorgeous uh, Monroe Top 5 Covers of the Week. Stormbreakers variant. Uh, then we have uh, issue 1 of Heroes Reborn, Weapon X, and Final Flight. And there's the variant there. From Image Publishing, we have issue 3 of Home. Uh, Dark Horse Comics is up next with issue 2 of The House of Lost Horizons. Kind of an interesting tale. Uh, from Archaea Publishing, we have Jim Henson's The Storyteller, Trickster. And that is, I believe, issue 4. Uh, from Image Publishing, and I think you're going to see a lot of this in the upcoming weeks, um, Mark Millar's Jupiter's Legacy Requiem, issue 1. Several variants for Jupiter's Legacy Requiem Issue 1. Uh, blank cover variant. If you're going to a Comic Con or a comic store where there's an artist drawing, that's a great one. Uh, the, the Silver um, Incentive variant. And then the Gold is a Store Thank You variant. Then from DC, Legends of the Dark Knight Issue 2. Then the uh, variant cover is right there. And um, one of our top covers of the week is the Legends of the Dark Knight issue 2. Um, I think it's a 1 in 25 variant, if I'm not mistaken. Let's get a little full. I'm going to go ahead and move that off. Up next will be Boom Studios with issue 5 of Luna. Thank you. And just an outstandingly beautiful cover, but the Variant cover is even more beautiful, so we gave it a top five cover of the week. Uh, then also from Boom Studios, The Many Deaths of Lila Starr, issue three. Smoking like that, I can see how what caused one of the deaths anyway. And then the uh, foil variant is uh, just beautiful. Scout Comics is up next with issue one of Midnight Western Theater. Marvel comes in next with issue three of the Mighty Valkyries. And uh, there's the variant cover and yet another variant cover for the Mighty Valkyries issue three. Uh, then also from Marvel we have Miles Morales Spider-Man, the Clone Saga, and that is issue 27 for Miles Morales Spider-Man. And then that is the variant cover there. Uh, from Titan Comics, we have issue three of uh, Minky Woodcock, The Girl Who Electrified Tesla. And uh, that's the variant right there. Let me see what we have over here next. We've got, from Marvel, New Mutants, issue 19. And uh, there's variant cover, and then a design variant right there. Uh, then we have from DC, Nightwing, issue 81. And uh, just a beautiful and uh, in the running for cover of the week um, variant cover for Nightwing. Uh, their Pride variant is gorgeous. That will be uh, on display with our other Pride variants. We have a whole section of Pride variants that are available this month, part of our support. Uh, Dark Horse Comics is up next with Neil Gaiman's Norse Mythology, Issue 1. And again, one of our top five covers of the week is the Issue 1 uh, variant. Just beautiful. Uh, then from Marvel, we have um, Planet Size X-Men, Issue 1. And just a myriad of variants for that book as well. As you can see, we grabbed quite a few. Uh, Aftershock Comics is up next with Project Patron, Issue 3. Then from Image, we have Radiant Black, a very interesting tale from uh, Kyle Higgins, and it's Issue 5. And uh, that is the beautiful Radiant Black Issue 5 variant right there. Dark Horse Comics is up next with Rangers of the Divide. 
DC's up next with uh, Represent, Issue 1. Um, AWA Upshot is up next with Issue 3 of Michael Straczynski's The Resistance Uprising. Vault Comics comes in next with Issue 10 of Resonant. From Dynamite, uh, we have Issue 10 of Sacred Six. And actually one of our top five covers of the week. And here's some of the variants for Sacred Six. Issue 10. From Boombox, we have Issue 1 of Save Yourself. And that's the variant, which is very pretty. DC is up next with Scooby-Doo, Where Are You? Issue 110. Boom Studios comes up next with Issue 9 of Seven Secrets. And then from Aftershock, uh, we have Issue 1 of Seven Swords. And uh, this is the... Uh, Thank you variant for Seven Swords, issue one. Uh, Aftershock is also up next after that with issue two of Silver City. And then from Image Publishing, issue three of The Silver Coin. And the intriguing variant for Silver Coin, issue three. IDW comes in next with issue 41 of Sonic the Hedgehog. And then from Dynamite Publishing, we have Sonya Versal, Issue 5. And uh, that is the Sonya Versal, Issue 5 variant. Uh, and then from Ablaze, we have Issue 1 of Sp Space Pirate Captain Harlock. And uh, that's the variant for Space Captain, Space Pirate Captain Harlock. Harlock, and then from Marvel we have Star Wars issue 14, and then the uh, 50th anniversary of Lucas Films, um, New Hope, and then the Pride variant um, is right there for Star Wars issue 14. Up next from IDW will be Star Wars The High Republic, Issue 5. From DC, uh, we have Static, Season 1. And that is the Static Season 1 variant right there. And this is yet another Static Season 1 variant. And then we have that. And then we have a Lunar Distribution Store Thank You variant. Kind of unique. Uh, then from Image Publishing, we have Chip Zdarsky's Issue 8 of Stillwater. DC comes up next with part of their Infinite Frontier, Supergirl, Woman of Tomorrow, Issue 1. And a beautiful variant cover for that. Made our top five covers of the week. Uh, up next from DC is Superman, Red and Blue, Issue 4. And uh, as you can see, uh, just gorgeous variant on that, um, runner-up to cover of the week. And uh, yet another variant there of Superman Red and Blue, Issue 4. From Image Publishing, we have Time Before Time, Issue 2. And uh, that's the variant cover there of Time Before Time. Uh, then from DC, we have uh, Issue 5 of Truth and Justice. And then the Pride variant for Truth and Justice, Issue 5. Uh, then from Image Publishing, we have Ultra Mega, Issue 4. And our Ultra Mega variants, as you can see in the top corner, have been damaged somewhat. We'll get those replaced as well. So if you end up buying one, you will be able to bring it in and swap it out for the good ones when they arrive. Uh, then from Marvel, we have... Um, Issue 35 of Venom, which is also the 200th issue of Venom. And it's the final epic installment from Donny Cates and Ryan Stegman. So enjoy, all of you. It's a big, robust book. But that's the A cover. I'm just going to show you all the variants we brought in. We tried to bring in as many covers as we could so that you would have some choices. 
Venom, Donny Cates' Venom has been uh, kind of like Scott Snyder's Batman. It's just wildly popular. Everyone has loved it. You can see the artwork they've done is just phenomenal on all these covers. Just beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. We're just going to collectively put them in as all top five covers of the week because they just are all phenomenally well done. Uh, then from Valiant Publishing, we have issue six of The Visitor. And uh, then from Image Publishing, we have issue 17 of The Walking Dead Deluxe. And these are some of the variants for Walking Dead Deluxe. That's a great cover. Top five cover of the week. Um, and there's another one. And then last but not least, from Marvel, we have issue two of X-Corp. And then um, the design variant for X-Corp issue two. And then our final variant of issue two. So that's all the comics and Chotsky that came in this week. Uh, remember, all these items will go on sale at 10 a.m. on Wednesday, June 16th. And we hope to see you here at Fox Comics in beautiful downtown Marion.